Hi, I'm Mr. Wahlberg, and I'm glad you're here. Hello, Forensics fam. The people on this email have expressed interest in Spring Semester Debate, which is part of the SJA Speech and Debate program. Spring Semester Debate is part of a game called Forensic Speech, which is a confusing name. I promise we're not going to cut up any dead people. The word forensic basically means public, so a forensic scientist works for the government, and forensic speech is public speaking. This email has four purposes. One, to introduce myself as a teacher and coach. Two, to give a glimpse of the format of the sport. Three, to give families an idea of our schedule. And four, I'm an over-communicator and long emails are my love language. This may seem like a lot at first. You're going to understand once we get started. It's also great, and I think you're going to love it. One, introduction. I'm Joe Wahlberg, SJA's Director of Speech and Debate. I've been teaching at St. James Academy since 2009 and coaching speech and debate since 2021. I'm excited to be here. Previous to this, I'd coach Scholars Bowl, Mock Trial, Science Bowl, Thunder Broadcasting Network, Track and Field, and probably a couple of other things I can't remember right now. I'm an excellence-minded coach who wants to see the actors and speakers and debaters perform at their best. This game is a lot more fun when people see success. I'm also a growth mindset coach who believes that uh, players need experience and experimentation and a safe place to try and fail so that they can eventually succeed. We will see success this year, but we will also be patient in making those goals become reality. It's a game that rewards work and attitude. Our program is good for people that have very little public speaking or debate experience, or for people that have been on the stage for many years already. Come as you are, you'll get plenty of room to grow. We also have 1.5 assistant coaches in our stable. Luke is a sophomore and engineering student at the University of Kansas. Luke is a four-year debater at Shawnee Mission Northwest. He's an Eagle Scout and a good guy. Luke's main role is as a wise judge for us during practice scrimmages and helping with the judge requirements at some, ter at some tournaments. He's likable. You'll like him. Owen is a sophomore philosophy and pre-law student at the University of Kansas. He was a four-year debater at Pittsburgh High School and was a three-time qualifier to the national tournament in Lincoln Douglas. Owen is also pretty likable, but his school schedule keeps him at KU most of the time and Honestly, debaters may not actually see him this season. Owen helps with writing and research for our LD squad, and we appreciate his work. Two, what is this game? Speech and Debate is a competitive inter-school program of speech, debate, drama. It's maybe the best and most valuable thing you can do with your time as a high school student, and I say that honestly and without overstating it. I really believe this is among the greatest of the high school activities. High school debate looks a little different in Kansas than it does in the rest of the country. Most states do several types of debate year-round, but in Kansas, we divide them into fall and spring semester seasons. There are four main types of debate in Kansas. In the fall semester, we do policy debate. The high-stakes, two-person debate, it's great. When people from Kansas say they debated in high school, they almost always mean they played policy debate. In the spring semester, we do other types of debate. Congressional debate, Lincoln-Douglas debate, and public forum debate. SJA doesn't currently offer PF, but we may offer it one day in the future. Students in debate events will learn how their games work, how to write cases and speeches, and how to defend their position. Spring season debate is an after-school activity that practices separately from the rest of the speech and drama forensic squad. It's totally extracurricular and does not have an academic class or grade. You, or your child, has expressed interest in one of these two kinds of debate— Congressional debate is a large group debate. There's no partners, but there probably are other St. James students in the room. It discusses the kind of topics that might occur in a government. This style of debate uses parliamentary procedure, like is used in uh, business and government. You listen to and answer opponents using evidence from experts and from your own analysis. Congress is competitive, but it's cooperative. You work with others in the room, but put up individual scores to win. In Kansas, Congress is fun and kind of clubby kind of debate. It has its own state championship tournament online called the Sunflower Congress Championship. It's a tournament hosted by the head coaches of Kansas. Congress is an NSDA event that may qualify you to go to the national tournament of the National Speech and Debate Tournament. Lincoln-Douglas debate is a one-on-one -on -one debate, you versus a single debater from another school. LD debaters compete to win the ballot of a single judge, discussing real-world topics using moral and ethical philosophy. You listen to and answer opponents using evidence from experts and your own analysis. LD is a fun style of debate. You practice on both sides of the topic, for and against the subject, even at the same tournament. In Kansas, its state championship is part of the speech and drama tournament held in May. LD is an NSDA event that may qualify you to go to the national tournament of the National Speech and Debate Association. Our program is governed by three organizations. One, 
St. James Academy. Two, the Kansas State High School Activities Association. Three, the National Speech and Debate Association. NSDA's Honor Society is called the National Forensic League, and it's one of the oldest and most respected high school honor society in America. Now, this is important. Spring season debate has a small activity fee to cover some team expenses. $75 pays for NSDA membership, as well as food, transportation, and research costs. Students who are enrolled in the speech and drama performance class only pay $25 because most of these expenses are already covered in the course budget. If an activity fee is the reason that you wouldn't participate in debate, please let me know. We have some options to allow everybody to play the game. We would also like to see this team get bigger. If you know someone who would enjoy the team, I'd like to meet them and see if we can find a way to make it work. Now, the season starts pretty early in January, so it's better to get everybody started right away. Three, schedule. We have five required tournament weekends on our schedule. Four of those tournaments are ones that we're competing in and one that we're hosting. Two to four other tournaments are optional. LDers may also compete in some online debate tournaments. There are some online National Circuit Congress tournaments, but they're better suited for players with a little more experience than our current Congress squad has. They are an option in the future, though. Debaters may qualify for the state and national championship tournaments. Tournaments are on Fridays. The speech and drama forensic events are held on Saturday, but if you're not in speech and drama performance class, you don't need to go on Saturday. This is our schedule. The five mandatory dates. Mandatory, January 26th. We're hosting. This will require some adult help. I'll explain that in a second. Mandatory, February 9th. Mandatory, February 23rd. Mandatory, March 22nd. Mandatory, April 19th. There are four optional dates. Optional, February 16th, March 1st, April 5th, and April 12th. There are three qualification tournaments. On May 4th, the Kansas State Tournament for Lincoln Douglas. Uh, on May 11th, the Sunflower State Tournament for Congress debate, Congressional debate. And June 16 through 21 is NSDA Nationals in beautiful Des Moines, Iowa. You have to qualify to get to those events. On Fridays, when you're competing, you'll be dismissed early from school during your last class of the day, fourth hour or eighth hour, depending on which day of the block we're on. You'll change into professional clothes. Boys, dress shirt and tie. Uniform pants are fine unless you want to change into something else. A uh, blazer or suit is even better than that. Please, nothing with the St. James Academy logo on it. Your clothes don't need to be expensive, but you should look professional. Girls' dress code is a little more undefined. Uh, Google executive woman and dress like you're in charge of the board of directors. I'm sorry I can't give you any more advice here. Again, it doesn't need to be expensive, but it should look professional. Then we will gather by the chapel, we'll pray together, and then drive the Thunder Bus to the tournament and go compete. Hopefully we'll win a bunch of medals and be back at St. James by about 8 o'clock. The actual end time depends on the tournament, and it varies from tournament to tournament. This may sound confusing, but it will make sense once we get started, I promise. I want to have a note on here. Debate tournaments use adult judges, and they're usually provided by the host schools. We will ask our debaters to find a person, that's usually a parent or a sibling who's graduated high school, to judge a couple of rounds of debate on Friday afternoon of the tournament we're hosting. No debate experience is necessary, though if you have some, that's pretty awesome. Four, communication. My inbox, my email inbox rules my life. If you want me to know something or remember something, put it in writing and send it as an email. I'm sometimes scatterbrained, and so do us both a favor and create a paper trail. Parents only may contact me via text message and the phone numbers in the email. If you have an emergency, no students, please, texting me uh, in compliance with Virtus rules. I This isn't a way I'm going to get fired. Once the season starts, we're going to make a group, like a team group me uh, for any informal communication along the way. Things that don't need a whole email, you need answered fast and maybe can crowdsource an answer. We'll have a group me for that. We'll have a parent meeting, probably a Zoom meeting at the beginning of the semester to go touch base. There will be periodic team emails that come out during the season. They'll go to parents and players, just like this one. I probably won't record those. They'll probably be along also, because I like to be complete, as our Heavenly Father is complete. Uh, look up Matthew 5, 8. And that's all for now. St. Columba of Iona, patron of speech and debate, pray for us. In him, Joe Wahlberg. If you've watched a lot of these videos, you might realize that, like, the place I'm recording looks a little different. It's still my, my basement desk, uh, but we're remodeling my wife's home office. And so over break, she's moved into my basement desk. And this is crazy. Like, look how many monitors she's got here. She's got one, two, three monitors. There's another one that you can't see down here. It's like an evil layer. I think she just sits down here and types and goes, <laughs> this part isn't in the email, but thanks for making it this far. See you. God bless you.